Hello YouTubers, this is the Nubifier, and welcome to part two of the Advanced Voice Attack series. Voice Attack is a voice to macro software that's fully programmable. It's been used in the past for much more than it was originally intended. What I'm going to show you is some examples of macros that I've made. This will let you see some of the programming and how it's done. Hopefully, you'll be able to customize this in the future for yourself. If you have any questions, please put them in the comments. If you have any macro ideas, please put that in the comments too, and I'll help you with them. So let's begin. With each HCS voice pack, there are thousands of professionally recorded voice clips. Not all of them are used, but they're included nonetheless. I suggest that you become familiar with the sound clips. Don't hesitate to go through all the folders and click them all. And most importantly, think about ways to string them together. At the start of my two minute Orion demo, I executed a command, I'm coming back on board. This simple command actually serves no real purpose other than immersion. It's just a nice intro while you're animating into the cockpit. It's something that you can use on a Twitch stream or a YouTube video to make the transition into the ship a little bit more interesting. It's most important to work out all the steps that you're going to need to program to execute the desired results. If it's a very technical command, you should probably put it to paper. Let's begin. Click the edit profile and select new command. Now you'll see at the top, when I say. Replace that with the desired trigger. For this example, we want it to say, I'm coming back on board. For this particular example, I've decided to use the following clips. Please take note that they're all in different directories. Affirmative standby, securing the ship, space the final frontier, hello, and welcome back commander. All you need to do is set the commands in order. Insert pause commands, estimate the pauses between the commands, test it, and then adjust it. I'm coming back on board. Affirmative, stand by. Securing the ship. Space! The final frontier! Who was it that once said that? Hello. Welcome back, Commander. I've taken the liberty of readying the ship for departure. Check the manifest for both cargo and mission briefings before we launch. Thank you. You're welcome. You're going to want to synchronize the pauses with the entry animation so that everything lines up properly. Just a note that if you use files from the radio effect folder, it's going to add a cool helmet sound for when you're in the vacuum of space. This will work with all HCS voice packs. You just need to explore the sound files that come with your particular one and script it for the commands that you want to say. For the second example, I'm going to talk about something a little bit more complex. Two commands that work on a single trigger with pauses. This is a command I made called head on. That command automatically increases the shield power for 10 seconds, moves the shields to the front for five, restores shield balance, and then restores shield power. Let's take a close look of how that's constructed. We start with a voice acknowledgement. The shield state is set to neutral. The shield state is immediately set to front. The power is set bias to shield system. After five seconds, the shields are reset. After five more seconds, the power is reset. Head on. Okay, executing now. Shields equalized. Power balanced. You should probably avoid at all costs a head-on pass, but if you need to, it's nice to have this automated. Yes, I'm aware that you could probably execute this command manually, but you probably wouldn't bother because it's fairly complex. With this constructed and set, you will most definitely use this. I want to stress this command by saying it's very important to use the following commands in combat. Power to shields, power reset, shields front, shields back, shields left, shields right, and of course shields reset. Fighting a pilot who has positive active control over these ship systems can be really frustrating. He or she may appear to be invincible compared to other pilots, but it's not that. It's simply that they're exploiting these important ship systems the way that they're intended. So I'm going to stop it there, but I do plan to continue escalating the complexity of these tips that I demonstrate. Please take a look at the selection of HCS voice packs. My goal is to grow this channel and I can't do that without the help of citizens like you. Please like and subscribe to help me get the word out about Star Citizen. Fly safe and I'll see you in the verse.